So joining me to talk about said unnamed game is a creative director for Microsoft Studios, Adam Eisgreen. Welcome, Adam. Thank you so much for having me on the show. Love being Pleasure. here. Now, Adam, I understand that you've been in games for a long time. I have. Um, I am coming up on my 25th year making video games. So yes, yes. you can actually make a career out of being in games. Um, and, you know, I got my start in the DOS days. Remember DOS? Like, oh, yeah, dude. I played Zork all day. And, so um, I got my start in the DOS days doing mm -hmm. uh, role-playing games, D&D games. Um, but I spent a heck of a lot of time making real-time strategy games. I was at Westwood Studios for years working on the Command & Conquer series. Mm. Ooh. Earth and Beyond, mm. a whole bunch of great games there. Um, Petroglyph, Universe of War, Empire War. So a lot of history on PC, and I'm excited to get back to it. Well, I understand that this title is an homage to those roots, mm. and I'm still not going to tell you what it is, but I know you're curious, so let's head right in to this world-exclusive trailer. Adam, Adam, Adam. <laughs> Age of Empires was the first game I ever saved up my allowance to play as a kid. I'd, oh I'd my weed gosh. my grandma's garden all day. She'd give me like $2, <laughs> and I still stayed dedicated. Tell me about Age of Empires, man. Man, you know, nobody has been able to play this game except if they found the CD-ROMs for the last 20 years. And what's a CD-ROM? I know, really. These day and age, like, who even has a drive? <laughs> Um, you know, and this has been such a labor of love for us at Microsoft and our development yeah. partner at um, Forgotten Empires to bring back Age of Empires in such a wonderful definitive edition so everyone can experience it. I want to talk about all the stuff we saw in the trailer start to finish. Talk to me about the graphics. Those, those sprites are huh. gorgeous. We have redone every single asset in the original Age of Empires. Every animation, every tile set, every, everything that made Age of Empires great we have um, carefully and lovingly taken and made even better and better. Because I remember just watching the sprites move around in the original game. It was very blocky oh, and yeah, yeah. stuttery. We've 16 facings now, so those fonts don't jitter. You know, mm -hmm. uh, a ton of work has gone into making the game and the presentation right. amazing. What about audio? Oh, yeah. So we've re-orchestrated and re-recorded mm -hmm. the entire soundtrack to the game using an actual symphony this time. Um, it sounds wonderful. The people at the studios are constantly begging us yeah. to get the soundtrack already. <laughs> Now, I have to ask, there were some aspects of the gameplay back then that were a little janky. Yeah. <laughs> uh, have there been any updates to the gameplay in that regard? Yes. So not only have we done things like improved Fine Path, which is, of course, always a big thing in RTS games, uh, we've gone in and actually modernized the UI. Um, a lot of people forget that original age didn't even have an idle villagers button. So all of that stuff, attack move, all of those things that have, uh, people have come to expect. Control in groups? Yes, control yes, groups. Yes, 1A. Um, yep. So all of that stuff is all in the game now. So we've taken all of the learnings from the, yeah. the age games that followed and brought it up 
to those standards. And you know, in, in speaking of modernization, I saw that it said Xbox Live Multiplayer, mm -hmm. which, uh, as you may or may not know, that is the online matchmaking service that Microsoft yep. uses for PC games. I mean, uh, how are you utilizing that? Oh, well, we've completely redone how lobbies work and how games and matching works. You know, we have our friend uh -huh. system, of course, it's built into Xbox Live. So players should have a really amazing experience. We also have a yep. web portal so they can go and track progress and see their results awesome. against all the other players. So it should be a really wonderful experience to play. And what about the beta that we saw at the end of that video? Yes, so the um, game will be out later this year, but you can go right yeah. now to ageofempires.com and sign up for our multiplayer beta. Um, you know, RTS games are really, you know, our multiplayer is so important. And we want to make sure that this definitive edition of Age is the absolute best we can make it. Right. So, you know, multiplayer, please come, sign, play with us, make the game great. You asked me before we hopped on that you wanted to say one more special bit, yeah. a little bit of a tease. We understand that it's the 20th anniversary of Age of yes. Empires. What is it you wanted to say? So, yes, uh, Age of Empires, the whole franchise will be 20. It's hitting its 20 mark October of this year. Um, you know, and this is the start here at E3 with you, is the start of the celebration of 20 years of Age of Empires. And that party is going to roll. We're going to continue that. So you're going to hear from us again in Cologne, Germany at Gamescom in August. And uh, we're going to be having a really wonderful Age of Empires event there and talking a whole bunch about, I think, stuff you're going to want to hear.